in beautiful Tyler State Park in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. It has really good energy. It's all natural and it's something that my mother and I like about like the world. We like natural, we like positive things. I was in the park one day, went past a tree and I was like, wait, what was that? The whole front of the tree was gone so you could see clear through it and yet it is still standing. It was still giving shade. Animals could still get some shelter. And I thought to myself, that's like remarkable because it really spoke to me about the resiliency of nature. When I think about that tree, I think about where we are in, in business. You know, to stand unyielding to change is not always a good plan. To find ways to adapt as my tree did, that's what businesses need to do. They don't often take that kind of long view that is really so essential to long-term success. I've been fortunate to have a lot of really positive influences in my life and one of them for sure is my father. When I was two years old, he decided to enlist in the Army and become a helicopter pilot to go fight in Vietnam. My mother supported him wholeheartedly even though she had a little toddler at home. This park is a, a dedication to our veterans and it gives you moments of reflection. I actually flew that Cobra. So he sucks my name up on it too. He's always taught me that for every action of force, there is an opposite and equal reaction of force. If you're nasty to somebody and you're pushing at them, they're gonna push back. They want to do what they wanna do, but they want someone they can trust. That's the type of business owner that I work best with. You can't do any better than Kelly. As a kid, we used to play business. We would set up desks and it was an office and I was always organizing everything and running the business. I absolutely loved it and I never looked back. If you lined up 10 business owners, they would probably all tell you they want to grow. They are looking to have sustainably profitable businesses that make a positive impact in their communities, for their employees, and for themselves personally. I can't afford to hire anybody of Kelly's caliber, and I don't have full-time work for them. So it's really great for me to write the check every month and to be able to pick up the phone and call her anytime I want. Your organization should be authentic. We're in a very informed, connected and transparent market. So there's only one way to be, yourself. When I work with clients, they know they need something. They don't know what it is always. I talk to them about strategy and I talk to them about goals and I ask, well, what is it you're trying to do? It's a fire hose of options. So it's about sorting through that and being able to know what's going to help you move the needle the furthest, the fastest. She's going to see the richness in who you are. She finds the depth. The way I think of it is I'm driving the car and Kelly polishes the car. What we want to do is attract new clients to us, captivate them with our message, and then that motivates them to take the next step to work with you. I work with clients in helping them see possibilities.